Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to show you guys my travel binder, a new challenge binder that I will be bringing in and I'm going to stuff my um, travel expenses, um, savings challenge and envelope. So um, as you guys know, I do have my main vacation savings challenge that is found in my high priority binder that money is to fund vacate like family vacations my travel expenses um binder is to fund a trip to italy next year um so i'm doing a saving challenge for that so that way i can kind of keep the two expenses separately because as you guys know i have to have a separate everything that's how my my brain works so my best friend is graduating from nursing school next year and she wants to go to Italy and so of course I am going to go with her. So I have to save for that. Um, I'm not sure um, how much I'll need. Um, I'm not sure how long I'll be there. She's planning on like traveling Europe for like a couple weeks or a couple months. I'm not going to be doing that because I have um, a child that I just can't leave for weeks at a time. But um I do want to do at least like 10 to 14 days. Um, so not exactly sure like where she wants to go or what she wants to do. So I don't really know my budget yet. So I was thinking around $5,000 should be good. Um, I want to fly first class there. So I know um, just for flights in general, that's going to be expensive. So 5000 I think should be enough, right guys? I'm not too sure, but that's what we're that's where we're going to start. So, um I have my travel expenses binder here. I'll show you guys that in a minute. So, the saving challenge that I'm doing to fund this binder is this cute little passport challenge that I got from Sincerely Roxy Designs. I love it. I have a lot of her challenges. I just love her designs. I feel like they're very creative and unique. So this is a passport to paradise. So I thought how fitting to use it for a international uh, vacation. So um, I did already try tried filming this video and then my phone cut off. So I already filled this out, but I'm just gonna show you. So it has, um, it comes with this passport and then the little stamps that go with it. Um, in different denominations so you have like the blank pages like this and then you would just put the sticker on here as if you're stamping it and then once this um, is filled up I believe it's four thousand dollars not too sure I don't really remember but I think it's four thousand so um, I have this money here 100 200 300 400 500 600 700 800 dollars now this money is actually from my credit card rewards so i had just been saving that money um i didn't really know what i wanted to do with it and then so that's why i was just like letting it stack and stack and then i was like you know what i'm going to pull that money out and use it to go towards my vacation so I cashed it out and that is, you know, that is that. So um, I do plan on getting a travel um, credit card soon so that way I can start racking up miles and then hopefully like that will help offset either hotel costs or definitely flight costs. So I have $800 here that we are going to put in here and I already have $115. So I was able to fill up this page as well as half of this page. So like I said, I was already filming that. Um, so that's why that was already done. So I have the $800 here. So today is, I don't know, 16th maybe. So 800. And then with my next bill condensing, um, I will swap this money out, put in my placeholders, and then, um, then I can do um, the, uh, put the placeholders in here. 
Okay. So we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 850, 870, 890, 910, and 915. Almost at $1,000. 915. And then I will only need $4,000 more. <laughs> so I have this. We'll put that in here. And then put this away. So then once I get my, once I replace this with my prop bills, then this is where my travel binder comes in. So I have this binder here and this is what I will be using for my trip. So the categories I have are flights and then each one of these has its own little challenge too. So flights, um, I want... Now, I like I said, I don't, I made this binder before I was planning on doing it, like before the Italy trip was even a thing. So I just put like random amounts for each category. So for the flights, I put 1300. I'll probably need more than that, like, or less. I'm not sure. So we're just going to shoot for these numbers um, for now. So, and if I have to like, um, uh, like mix around some numbers, then I can. So flights, um, the goal is 1300. We have a savings challenge for that. Next is hotel. Hotel, I put 2000. I probably don't need that much, right? Like I said, I don't know. So 2000 for hotel is the goal. Car, weather, uh, we're definitely not going to rent a car because I don't want to deal with driving in another country, but like Uber, um, trains, just transportation in general. So, um, I put a thousand dollars. So we have a couple savings challenges for that. Um, experiences. So, um, excursions or sightseeing or all of that. I put a thousand, got a challenge for that. Food, I put a thousand. Probably will need more in food. I'm not sure. And this all, like I said, this all depends on how long I'm going to be there. Um, and then, like, me and my best friend obviously would be like splitting the cost of like hotel and car and things like that. Uh, food, we already did, which was a thousand. Spending, so this is for souvenirs, um, shopping, things like that. I put 750, but that might be a little too um low and then so i have a challenge for that tips four hundred dollars to tip like um uh to tip people <laughs> and then back here i have a disney vacation um envelope savings challenge situation so one thing on my bucket list, as you guys know, like I love taking my daughter to Disney. She loves Disneyland. Um, we just got done with our Disney cruise and she loved that too. So um, I'm already planning on booking another one for next year. So um, all things Disney right now, it, we're really into. My daughter's only three. So I just want to do as much Disney stuff with her as I can now because she's only going to be small one. She's only going to be into Disney for so long, right? So I just want to um, do all the things Disney with her while it's while it interests her. So one thing on my bucket list is I want to be able to visit all the Disneylands. And I want to take her to all the Disneylands. So this was just um, the um, to save up for that. So my bucket list is to go to all the Disneylands. So Shanghai, Paris, Hong Kong, Tokyo. Of course, we have to go to Disney World. Um, so there's that. And then this is just... Um, little trackers for that and then another thing that I put on my my little bucket list for Disney is so they have I think about five different ships or cruise um, cruise ships so one of my bucket lists is to 
go on every single cruise ship that they have. <laughs> so the one that we just went on was the Disney Wonder. Um, next year, when we go to the Bahamas, that will be the Magic. And then there's Wish, Fantasy, and I believe there's one called Treasure, but I'm not sure. So that's another bucket list item of mine. I know, um, I believe it's the Fantasy cruise line I think that one is overseas so that's like an international one like I'd never really been into cruises before um so I didn't like realize like <laughs> like cruises are offered in different parts of the world like so ignorant but like I didn't even think that so when I found out they had like an Australian um itinerary for uh Disney or they also have like a Mediterranean uh, itinerary. I was like, what? I didn't know. Like, I don't know. <laughs> I just, I don't, I didn't even think like cruise ships would be like, I don't know. Okay. That's stupid. But yeah. So, um, that's another, um, another bucket list of mine. So when I, um, like I said, when I get, when I do a prop swap, I will take that money out of the my um low priority binder and then I will start stuffing it into these categories so that is that the next thing I wanted to show you is my new savings challenge binder and I know you guys are like what the heck like you have so many savings challenges why are you doing another one because I'm crazy and it's fun and it helps me save money. Yes, I am spending money on these challenges, but I'm saving more money by doing these challenges. So I have this binder here. Now this binder is going to be used um, to um, help me pay for the uh, cruise for next year. Um, so I'm still going to do my high priority savings challenge for my vacation category but this one is going to be designated specifically for that trip next summer and then the money that I put into my general um, vacation challenge will just be money for vacations in general so if I need more money to go like if I'm short uh, money for like any of these um, vacations and I can pull it from there that probably doesn't make sense to you guys but again in my mind it makes sense so I have this binder here and um, it is just one of those like ones that have like the pockets and then you stuff the money so I thought this was super cute it has low denominations which helps me this is the tracker here and it adds up to 2100 so we have that so I decided that I was going to stuff five dollars that's all I could afford right now to start this challenge but I wanted to start it so I have this how do I have to fold it okay so I'll fold them into thirds and then Flip it into here and there we go and then I will color this in let's do blue for our vacation so there we go so um, next time I do this I'm going to start with from biggest to smallest so I'll start stuffing the 30s, then move to the 25s, the 20s, 15s, 10s, and 5s. I got this from, I believe her shop name is Budget by Number. I oh yeah, Budget by Number. So that's where I got that from. So once all of these are filled, this will equal $2,100, which I'm going to need more than that for, my, for the Disney vacation because we'll be um, flying out of the... Um, port in Florida to go to the Bahamas um and I'm getting a balcony room and I think it's about four thousand dollars just for 
like the room and stuff and not including like taxes and prepaid gratuities um so because my dad covered this this vacation that we just went on i'm covering next year he's gonna have to cover the flights though <laughs> so um so yeah so i'll need more than just 2100 but um like i said i can pull it from my regular um vacation uh, fun. So I just wanted to show you guys that because this is something else that I'll be bringing in that you'll see on my channel for me to stuff. So this is to go specifically to our cruise. And then um, this one, the passport one is going to the um, vacation with my best friend. Oh, and then one last thing I wanted to show you guys is I've still been using um, my planner and as you guys know in the very back it does have um, it does have a vacation planner um, so I'll definitely be using this. So I'll be using this for um, the cruise and then also for um, the vacation with my best friend. So I may film videos of this. Obviously I'm not going to write like the travel dates that I'm planning on going on um, like my exact travel dates, but um, yeah, we'll just, I'll probably, you know, do this and film it for you guys. I don't know. So, um, yeah, that is all I wanted to show you guys. Please feel free to ask any questions, leave a comment, like this video, subscribe if you, subscribe if you are not already subscribed, and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.